guys, welcome to today's video. By popular demand, I'm now doing a headstand guide. So it's going to be a five part guide. We're gonna focus on stretching. We're gonna focus on the wall. We're gonna focus on tripod headstand. We're gonna then move on to yogi headstand. And then we're gonna go into some skills. I'm gonna try and make them not too long, just so it's things that you can work on at the end of each practice when you're nice and warm. But we're gonna start with our stretching today. So we're gonna be focusing on the upper body the hamstrings and our core area. So we're gonna start by coming into a downward facing dog. So if you wanna meet me there. So with our downward facing dog, we're just gonna have a little stretch here. If you wanna take a walk, just raise each leg at a time. And then you're gonna push through your upper body, bring your shoulders down, stretch out the upper body. And really raise your tailbone up and pull your heels to the mat. Keep your gaze up and have a nice stretch here. Now we're going to roll our body into a high plank, step our feet back if we need to and lower our body to the mat. Have one breath here, tuck your toes back and push up into your high plank, back into your downward facing dog. Once again, have a walk. Stretch that upper body and take your gaze up. Now from here, we're gonna come down onto our forearms and come into a dolphin. So just gently walk your feet forward. And then from here, try and bring your heels down to the mat and stretch out those hamstrings. push up onto our forearms and walk our feet all the way to our hands and to have a forward fold. Inhale, come back up, forward fold. Inhale, come back up. And then we're going to take ourselves all the way down, sit on the mat and just come into a comfortable position. So whether that's cross-legged, Half lotus, full lotus, whatever you want to do. We're going to stretch our hands out in front of us, palms facing away. Take a couple of breaths. Then arms over our head. Release the arms down and then stretch our arms out behind us and release the palms so they're facing away from our upper body. So I'll show you the twist. The hands out behind you, twist the palms away from you. Have a really good stretch here in your shoulders. And release the arms down. Now we're going to take the right arm over to the left hand side and left arm goes underneath. So stretch out the right shoulder. Repeat for the other side. So left arm over to the right right arm underneath and pull that shoulder over to the side. Now we're going to do the reach over the top. So bring your right arm over. I'll just show you from the back. So right arm comes over. If you want to just keep it like this with your left hand, bring the right arm down and help pull it. If you have more flexibility, bring your left arm towards the back and connect the arms together. Then stretch that right shoulder out and allow it to have a deep stretch throughout your scapula. And release the arms down. And now we're gonna repeat for the left hand side. So left arm goes down, if you want to just Focus on bringing that arm down. But if you have the flexibility, right arm comes around to knee. You'll find one arm is a lot more flexible than the other. So when you've got hold of it and a nice strong grip, stretch that left shoulder out and allow it to pull the right shoulder at the same time. And relax. 
the arms, give them a shake out. Now we're gonna come onto our neck. So we're gonna start by holding the neck with our left arm and then just bringing it towards the left hand shoulder. Relax the neck and repeat for the other side. So right arm goes over and bring it over to the right shoulder. And relax the neck and then we're just gonna look to the left. Exhale back to the middle and inhale to the right. Exhale back to the middle, then inhale all the way up. Exhale all the way down and just place your hands on the top of your head just to guide the head down. Now we're going to come into a child's pose. So knees to the corners of your mat, toes touch, heels on your bum and stretch out into a child's pose. From here we're going to thread our right arm underneath and look under our left shoulder. Back to the centre in child's pose. Left arm underneath. Look under the right shoulder. Back to center. And then we're going to walk our hands all the way over to the left hand side. Then all the way over to the right hand side. Back to center. And relax. So guys, that is your warm up for your headstand. We're now gonna go onto some wall drills. So if you're ready, join me in the next episode and we'll start straight away.